I dreamed I did my hair up in curls last night. See. When hopes might life worth And I want my hair to be damp, not wet. So while it dries a little bit, I'm going to comb it out and set it in the direction that I want to part it. The first time I did this, I did it with center parting. So now I'm going to go with a little bit of side parting. And another thing you want to do is make sure your hair doesn't dry too much. If you're not doing this, you know, with damp hair, then I think you would need some setting lotion. Now that my hair is done, it's really silky straight. Which is fine on a daily basis and it's great the way it is. But sometimes, you know, you want a little change. So what you're going to need um, are thick ribbons or long scarves that are not too thick. I'm using something like this. This is another one. It's sort of like a belt. Another thing I have is netting that can twist it. It can go quite thin as well. So basically the idea is something soft and thin and long. You're also going to need something just to hold your hair as it curls in place, just hold the ends. So I used ordinary rubber bands. You can use like one of these telephone um, scrunchies. So grab a portion of your hair. You want to decide how many sections using how thick you want your sections to be. You can do three twists of curls for your entire head. I like to do them a little finer. But what you need to make sure is that all your um, sections are the same thickness. I've got the section of hair and now I'm going to take my long rope ribbon thing and tie it. I've got this which I'm going to coil my hair around. To get the effect that I want, I take the hair and I bring it around but I twist it every time I go a single round so that I have kinky curls not just straight. And I keep smoothing and twisting until I reach the end and I twist the very last bit around so I want it to be taut so I take the end here and I tie it to make a knot together with this bit here now I take the remainder which is pretty long and I'm going to do another bit of hair coil it around tie it back up here then do it here and tie it back up so that I'm using one long chain of fabric. Twist and loop around. Twist and loop around keeping everything very tight. So again, I've started on this side, I've sectioned out and smoothed which part of the hair I'm using, I'm going to tie a knot. Now I have the rack curls done and they're mostly at the side of my head. Now it's been 10 hours or so and I'm just going to start taking the hair out. So now my hair is curly and it's full of these kinky curls. So I'm going to separate each of these sections in half. I learned how to curl long hair using this method from a website called Rapunzel Resource and I put a link to it in the description box.